Hi there, my name is Marcel Furst and I welcome you all to my third episode of Overland Vagabond. This is a second video of a series dedicated to the vehicle that we will drive while on the journey. Last time we discussed the platform choice and I explained why I opted to build my own expedition vehicle and picked a Ford Ranger Wildtrek as its platform. Today it's about the choice of a cell as a habitat and a living space. There are several manufacturers that offer ready-to-use cells. Gazelle, Azale, Alpha Cap, Tisher, Rayon, Mondo Pickup, Module Idea, B Mobile, Earth Roamer, and these to name the most known in Europe. In USA or Australia, you can find another set of beautiful and well-known cells. The distinguishing attribute of most of them is that they are removable. That means you can use the pickup with its loading bay during the week. And for the weekend or for your holidays, you quickly load the cell onto the loading bay and you go for your overland trip. To me, and again, this is a very personal preference that may turn out to be different for any of you. This is suboptimal, as I would have to compromise space and weight, having to drive around with a load in me for which I have no real use. If your interest is for a more permanent solution and you wish to replace the loading bay completely, then the list of manufacturers shrinks to a handful at best. The reason is that adaptation and customization efforts are, from a functional and styling perspective, much higher than with the tray loaded ones. And making molds for singular pickup models is economically not scalable. The market is way too tiny for that. Furthermore, the chances are high that you end up with one of those square boxes built with flat panes of composite material, with a couple of windows milled on each side, not really aerodynamically efficient and pleasant to the eyes. There are, though, a couple of good alternatives. My choice fell to an Austrian company, Geocar, and I opted for the Condor Plus model which is the most high-level one. Why? Well, for different reasons, but mainly, number one, high level of customization. The Condor Plus could be built and configured exactly to my own needs. Secondly, the manufacturer was open to let me complete the interior, delivering essentially the shell with a basic a basic interior build. Thirdly, lightweight. The roll cell only weights little more than the loading bay it is replacing. Fourth, strong and flexible. The cell is manufacturer with composite technology and is designed to cope with torsion forces instead of a solid box that is subject to stress. And lastly, aerodynamic and cool looking, as you can see from some of the picture I'm going to show you now.
So, what are the major highlights of this cell? It is adapted to my four doors for the Ranger pickup. It has a porthole that connects the cabin to the cell. Plenty of light, pop-up roof, window on the roof, window on each of the walls. Offers sleeping beds for two to four people. The dining area inside is for four people, although a bit tight. Has an interior kitchen that can be used outdoor as well. Carries 120 liter of water filtered twice. Has an indoor shower and a place to put a porta potty. Has a heater for warm water and to heat the cell during the icy nights. A pretty sophisticated electrical supply with solar cells. One fridge in the cell and one in the cabin. Plenty of cupboards and other space to store all the appliances, the bags and other stuff. In conclusion, I'm pretty convinced that the Condor Plus cell is the right choice for the sort of endeavor that we will undertake. It ticks all the right boxes. It allows me to render and finish it the way I want, and it's efficient and stylish. In the next episode, I will interview the owner of Geocar and creator of this Condor Plus cell. And you will learn a bit more about the cell and the engineer that crafted it. I hope these type of videos are inspiring to you. Please don't hesitate to ask questions, add constructive critiques, or simply press the thumbs up button. Thank you so much for watching. If you like what we do, Please subscribe and or leave a comment down below. See you next time.